happening today. A Montgomery manufacturing plant is celebrating and there will be a grand reopening with some new jobs. WSFA 12 News reporter Bethany Davis is live at the GenPak plant. Bethany, tell us what they have planned there today. Yeah, so GenPak is officially reopening this freshly renovated facility. It's adding 155 new jobs and keeping 145 jobs on the payroll for a total investment of about $22.8 million. This is Anna Buckley, who's the president and CEO of the Montgomery Area Chamber of Commerce. And Jeff Hebert is the uh, the manager here. He's the, the guy in charge here at GenPak. Let's talk a little bit about the fact that this is not a new company to this area, but man, this investment and this impact and that's pretty big. It's, it's big. It's a big day. You know, it's it's great to hear um, new announcements and things like that, but the really exciting thing in our community is when a company that's been here 40 years chooses to stay here, grow here, and expand here. Uh, they have great jobs. They, they do so much in the community. GenPAC is a wonderful corporate citizen, and so it's a great day for the Chamber to support GenPAC and welcome them in a new and expanded way to Montgomery. You're holding actually one of Jimpack's yes. products. So Jimpack produces these food containers. We get these when we get our food at places like Zaxby's. You have clients all over the country. You've just renovated this 400,000 square foot facility. So what exactly are those upgrades and what does that mean for you moving forward? Yep. So we, we're doing this in a two phase process. The first phase was get back and operating like we were before we had closed. Now we're up and running, we're expanding, we're going to double the size of the plant. The renovations we've looked at, we've increased the number of, of lines we have, the equipment that we run here, and we're increasing jobs. I couldn't have done it without the help of the chamber and everything they've done. And if you're looking for a job, we're open, and we'd love to have you take a look at AIDT.com and GenPAC.com and look us up. We're, we're very happy to be here and appreciate everything we Got from the chamber. 155 new jobs. What kinds of positions are we talking here? Uh, we've got anywhere from entry level all the way up to maintenance. Uh, we're going to be putting in automation, so we're going to need some some techs, and uh, we're looking forward to working with the local community and the schools to help train techs and uh, have some jobs for them when they're when they graduate. Yeah. So we're very excited. 155 is a big number for one yeah, company. Yeah. We'll stick around. We're going to talk a little bit more this morning about what that means, what message that sends, not just about this company, but about the workforce here in this community and this area and the message it's sending out around the state a little bit later, guys. All right, Bethany. And again, that ceremony starts at 10 this morning.